Infinite Tarot 888. This message is for Aries. Now you can have Aries anywhere in your chart. Sun, moon, rising, Venus. I'm here in Jupiter, baby. Check your chart. My spirit team is saying. Now, Aries, this may resonate with you or maybe just a piece. Take what does, baby, and leave the rest for someone else, baby. As I'm going and I was meditating through this reading, Aries, and I split the deck. Look at this. Let's talk about this, baby. You're in total conflict and it might be over love or something that you love to do. And my spirit team is saying that this conflict has a lot to do with something within yourself. For some of you, this conflict has to deal with a particular sibling that you're dealing with. Friend or partnership in business. For some, it may even be a spouse. See, we have love and we got the four of wands. Now, I don't see a lot of physical contact. It's something that is building within you. This conflict. And what my spirit team is saying is that this is going to be part of your test coming into 2023, baby. And see, the chosen ones, baby, put it in the comments. If you're a chosen one, you are always being tested to see how you are elevating or ascending. And this inner conflict. Some of you guys are being so patient on the outside. And I don't think a lot of you Aries have really realized how much you have elevated. And I'm hearing from my spirit team is, baby, you got some people from your past, whether it be in love, friendship, lover, business part. I'm hearing co-workers or just even this sibling that keeps popping up. That has been, they've been trying to put obstacles, roadblocks. I'm hearing slander and just doing the worst. I'm hearing, want to make you slap your mom. <laughs> I don't know if you want to take it that far, but some of you guys would have reacted in a totally different way, but you're, you're unpredictable. You have gained that inner strength. And some of you guys are asking the universe, God, source. It's almost like you're throwing, I'm, I'm, I'm seeing this image, I'm getting this download where you're throwing up your hands and, and just releasing it to the universe. It's like, I can't take this. Push me to a different direction or illuminate my, uh, my, my steps, God, universe. And I'm here and asking you to receive. But that emotion you're placing behind it is causing major manifestations. And this Aries reading came out late because some of you guys are in doubt with that conflict back and forth, back and forth. But the only difference what I'm hearing from my spirit team is that you're actually analyzing things from a higher perspective. And what it really bounced to is, baby, you moving in silence. And it has a lot of people terrified. They don't know your next move. Baby, I'm hearing this is chess, not checkers, baby. Put it in the comments, baby. Because I'm hearing you guys are fierce, baby. You guys are just powerful. In 2023, uh, for this is for my Aries. It's going to resonate with you being treated like a doormat in the past and this is this it wasn't that you was weak or nothing is you had a lot of love for these people these could have been your family somebody that was like family for a few of you that might resonate you might have even gave them a pet 
because you love them so much. And this person might have betrayed you. I'm, I'm getting the letter L, Y, F, C, J, C, or C, J, or D, J, or something like that. But this particular sibling might have teamed up with your ex or a co-worker and, and had you just dismiss at work or just put you in, in a situation ooh, that has you hot. For, for my Aries that are high vibrational and that have been passing every step, I'm hearing that every door that's being closed, you may sit there and think and not react. And my spirit team is saying you're on the right path. Because if you're not reacting, baby, that's exactly what the universe wants you to do, is to trust. And when you analyze that door, and you see that it might not be coming from the most high, and you I mean, I'm seeing these people that are Plotting against you, talking, they they get together and they're plotting. And you know what, Aries? So is God, the universe. He's seeing everything they're doing. But you not reacting in the way they want you to react, baby. It's bringing a lot of self-love to you. But this is like your, you got, you, there's so much love, baby, that you got coming. Look, this might be a Pisces that you're dealing with. And they're in low vibration. As they're talking about you, I'm hearing them plot against you. It's like the most high is watching everything. And before their pettiness, I'm hearing some of you guys, karma's a bitch. That's what I'm hearing. Put it in the comments, baby. If you're moving forward, because in reality, what I'm hearing from my spirit team is, their projection, they're projecting their insecurities on you. See, this message is going to resonate for a few of you guys, or most of them. What they don't understand, and you might be dealing with cancer, have cancer in your chart. What they're not trying, they're trying to figure you out. That what they don't understand is that some of you guys. were guided to help these particular people. Help them over and over. They've been betraying you. And trying to block your destiny, baby, but they can't see it. Some of them have even went as far as trying to get readings on you, trying to look into your Kashuk records, trying to figure out, but see, you're protected. God's source is almost blocking them. And man, there's three people trying to look to see, hey, what is Aries doing? But baby, Aries is moving on. And some of you Aries, you guys ain't looking back. And it's got a fire sign, baby, just looking towards you. Or this may be you, Aries. But I'm hearing you have a, a fire sign, a Leo, Sag, or an Aries that's just passionately trying to block your destiny. But look at you. You operate out of love, baby. And baby, water puts out fire is what I'm hearing from my spirit team. And see, the devil was right underneath the king of cups. Look at this, baby. You, I'm hearing a lot of you guys are fighting fire with fire. But baby, you, you extinguishing that fire, baby, with that love. And, and my spirit team is saying... Keep moving forward with love towards your passion. Don't let this devil energy put you in this fire energy trying to go against them. See, they want you to focus on your craft. There's a particular thing that you're doing, Aries. There's a talent, a gift that you've been putting a lot of work into. And the devil wants to come in here with distractions. To bondage you. I'm here to trauma bond you. Some of you guys are dealing with somebody that wants to trauma bond you. But you too busy winning, baby. Some of you guys, look. This is what you got coming because of the time that you've been putting in. 
You've been shining the light, baby. You, you, some of you guys are just so focused on your spiritual journey, baby. Put it in the comments, baby. Put it in the comments, baby, how powerful you are, how grateful you are, how amazing you are, how dedicated you are to this journey, baby. Because your ancestors, they're cheering you on. They're seeing how you're beating this devil energy. Wow. Some of you guys are seeing 333 or will be coming around. This is going to be a confirmation this weekend if you see 333. So I'm here in 777. Some of you guys, 000, zero, zero, baby. And when you see 00, zero, baby, good things are coming to you, baby. You started new. Some of you guys are so excited and moving forward. Y'all let go, baby. And even though you got to start as a page, baby, look at this. It's like you regain your innocence. And the devil wants to take that away from you. So Aries, don't allow that. Because right behind it, baby, you got the page of pinnacles. And look at this. You got the four of coins, baby. Look at this. And in this deck right here, it's like you got plenty of gold, baby, everywhere. You're not holding on tight to it like the other traditional deck. Baby, you looking to go around the world. And spirit wants you to protect this peace, baby, this innocence. You have a spiritual. You got a spiritual answer, a spiritual guide or an ancestor that's really protecting you. But you got your armor, baby. And that's with you being in this energy of the magician. Because there is this is your card. This is an Aries Virgo. You might be dealing with a Virgo. Look at this. Baby, you got the power to create. And Aries, if you're dealing with a particular situation that's been trying to hold you back, that you see. <laughs> if you're dealing with the situation that is causing you doubts of moving forward, you have the ability, the power to move. Some of you guys are just afraid to leave people in the past. I'm hearing from my spirit team, oh, because they're family, oh, what are they going to do? But the problem is they're holding you back. Look at this. Look at this. These two cards try to slide. My spirit team, look, you the star. And in between this, look, it's nothing but baggage that you're carrying the weight of other people, Aries. And spirit is watching. It's like saying, what are you doing, Aries? Let it go, baby. You the star. And that's your, <laughs> maybe dealing with Aquarius because Aquarius and you, it's like you guys skipped. <laughs> you guys were holding back to make a decision. And this might be confirmation, baby, because uh, my spirit team is saying, put it in the comments, baby. If you're a star, if you believe you're a star, if you want to embody the energy of a star, baby, because some of you guys are natural born leaders, baby, put it in the comments. And you're about to lead the way, but you got to let go of these baggages that don't belong to you. They're keeping you stuck. And look at this right behind this card right here. You feel a lot of my areas are going to resonate with this. Your past situation, whether it's work, family, a business or co-workers, they're holding you back. They see they know your potential, baby. They know this is you. Look at you shining bright. I'm telling you, you were working on your talents. And see, when you let go, these, these, this card was like this. Look at this. I don't have the camera looking down yet, but look at this. As you're fighting this battle, because a lot of you guys, Aries, you guys are some warriors, baby. If you can't claim this reading that you're a spiritual warrior... You're a generational curse breaker, baby. You're breaking patterns. And you just got this last pattern is what I'm hearing from my spirit team. It's like you have this last one is letting go of what no longer resonates with you because it's going to give you victory. Some of you guys are one. They're wanting you to walk away. And when as soon as you walk away, baby, you got victory right behind victory was look, your pinnacles, baby, the king of pinnacles. 
You don't have one spirit guide. You have two baby protecting you. Look at this. Look at that. The boom boom stick, baby. I'm hearing the wand, the magic wand, baby. The magic wand and the high priestess, baby. Your intuition is going to be on fire. And look at this. Money coming from the sky. There's a major blessing in you letting go. 15, 15 on the clock. Let's see what you got in love. Let's see. Let's get this one. In love for 2023 February. As I cut the deck, look at this. As soon as you walk away, if it's an ex, let that go, baby. Because they spying on you. Look at this. They still up to their BS. And see, spirit is trying to warn you. Spirit sent some angels, your spirit tip, your ancestors to warn you. There's a person watching how happy you are without them and they can't stand it. Look at that. 15, 55 on the clock, baby. They see you moving forward. So let's get three cards, baby. And look, before I even get the three cards, this is the energy you're about to embody if you're not there yet. The page. And they still going to be watching. Look how he's, look, he or she watching because Sarah has no gym. All right, let's get three cards. Four Aries, sun, moon, rise, and Venus. Anywhere in the chart. Hit the like button, baby. Share. If this is your energy, claim it, baby. I am amazing. I am wonderful. I am wealthy. I'm hearing I am rich. And look at this. I am the magician in my life, baby. I create and I manifest everything into reality, baby. Look at this. Put your affirmations in there. And you got this card at the bottom. Look at this. This confirmation, Harry's. And look at how tapped in you are. How tapped in you are. And this is why they're hating. This is why you're being unpredictable. And I'm hearing from my spirit team. It's not that you're being. It's that you are unpredictable. Why? Because you're following the steps, baby. That the most high is illuminating for you. And it's leading you, or it will be leading you to great success. Look at that, baby. Because you're following your heart. 1717 on the clock, baby. That's 88. You already know. 88, baby. Put it on the comments, baby. That's about to bring you abundance. Look at this. You healed your heart, Aries. And I'm hearing for a lot of you guys that are wanting to leave the past, baby, you try to heal these people, but some of them. <laughs> They, they're about to have to heal on their own. One more, they said, one more car. Look at this, Victor, man. These cars ain't lying. If you ain't claiming this energy, baby, I'm claiming it. As a matter of fact, I'm going to claim this energy. Look at this energy. You have victory twice. You have the magician twice. You have some major arcanas. You have the star twice, baby. I'm hearing it's only up from now. Look at this. Leo card. Hmm. Maybe it's a Leo that's bringing you down because I did say a fire sign. There's a Leo. So let's see. Let's get a spiritual message for you. And I'm going to pick one. It said, it's okay to start the fuck over if you have to. See, some of you guys are afraid to start over or you're just getting into that energy. And some of you guys for this Aries, because it's like spirit had me wait on your on your message. And it says right here, did you fuck up? And excuse my language, this is channeled. This is what they want me to show you. Did you fuck up? Start over? Did things fall apart? Start over. Every day is in a new beginning. Every moment is deep as fuck. I know, right? Quit holding on to old mistakes and shit. Still start the fuck over. Look at this, baby. Some of you guys want to take a snap picture and read this in the morning, every day. That's what I got for you, Aries. Hit the like button, share, subscribe. Help my channel grow. But most importantly, baby, say your affirmations, baby. I am fucking powerful. I am amazing. I am gorgeous. I am Victorious is what I'm hearing. And I'm hearing put that heart. Mm, baby, because you. 
Your aura is just love, power, and joy, and happiness. That's what I got for you. Infinite Tarot 888.